All right, there is no day like St. Patrick's Day to unwind, relax, and let yourself maybe have a little drink. And right now, we're trying out a little Irish spirit made with love right here in our city. The team from Wiggle Whiskey is here with a sampler for us, and that's going to help us kick off today's festivities. Alex Moser is joining us. It's always great to have you on the show, it's Alex. It's so much fun to be on, and it's weird not talking about skiing, but... Uh, I know, yeah, yeah, that's what you used to always talk went, about. Went from making snow to making whiskey. There you go. <laughs> All right. So, and you have a drink that's really perfect for St. Patrick's Day here. So tell us what's in this. This is the Yinzer coffee, of course. I mean, we really okay. went through some heavy market research to come up with that name. <laughs> and what this has, this is an ounce of uh, straight PA bourbon. It has okay. a half an ounce of our coffee liqueur. Okay, so there it is right there, the coffee liqueur. Yep, there's some brown sugar simple syrup in here. There's some nutmeg in here. And it is really good. And you guys are serving this today in the strip, right? Just today, tomorrow, whenever you want, we'll make it anyway. Oh, it's quite good. Oh, it's good, yeah, it's really and good. And it has a kick. It has a and little kick. And it puts kick. a little froth on, on the top of your lip, it, which it, is nice too. Very festive. It has a little kick, so yeah, that's that's kind of our ode to Irish whiskey, Pittsburgh yeah. style, and we're really excited about it. It's good, and I totally get like the St. Patrick's Day flavor of the whole thing. It does, I, I almost want some more. But yeah, it's okay, well, it's okay. a very big mug. We'll get to that a little <laughs> later on. But you also brought us this whiskey flight because this this is something you guys have been waiting for and it's really quite special. Well, it, I feel a little guilty because I'm new to the company yeah. and riding on the coattails. This is our oldest uh, rye whiskey in the, the black right one. Right here, nope, oh, the one black more. one, right here, okay. This is our oldest rye whiskey we've ever had and we're releasing this on the 30th of March at the distillery. It's the only chance you can have to buy the bottles, come to the party, it's a birthday party. And it's, it's a birthday party for Wiggle Whiskey. It's our 11th year birthday, but we're celebrating, this is our oldest whiskey, and then you know, we're also gonna try our so oldest bourbon. This will not be released until then, Correct. and everyone can try it then, and we're trying it for the first time. Right? I haven't even tried it yet. Our, our distillers okay. would not let me try it yet. It, is it, there a trick when you're drinking whiskey? Should you do, like, you know, with wine, they tell you like, Yep. You know, hold it sideways and sniff it and all that kind of stuff. We, we, we say to sniff it. Okay. So give it a little sniff. Oh. Then another one. That's nice. Okay. Now go for the sip. Little sip. Don't little swallow sip. it right away, though. Little sip. Yeah, and, keep and it in your, your mouth. mouth. Yep. All right. You try it first here, and I'm going to watch as you, <laughs> as you swallow. And we're going to see Alex's reaction because oh, that's, you have not tried it before. That's nice. Okay. That, that's really nice. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it too. And while I'm trying it, I want you to talk about the next one in the flight. So but I want to try it right here. I just the, the rye. What you're drinking is a Monongahela rye, and that's local to this area. And rye has a little bit of a bite. Do you like it? <laughs> I do like it. <laughs> it's five o'clock. But it has a bite. It does have a bite. It has a bite. It makes your tongue tingle, but it's really good. Right. And I, I think it's really nice. The wine drinker, I'd probably say this might be. A, kind of like a cab where it has that bite to it. Right. Um, so that's that's that. Now, this is going to be... this is special. You can tell this is special. Well, you're okay. going to like this even more. Okay. Than probably. So this is bourbon. This is a made, okay. This is 51% corn as opposed to rye. Okay, that's what I was going to ask you, what the difference is. Okay. Yeah, so this so is... This is corn is involved in, in making this and correct. distilling this. Correct, correct. So okay. this was, um, this has been in a single barrel for the last eight years. Okay. So we were, we were much younger when this went into a barrel. <laughs> and... Um, you're gonna like this too. Same thing. And do you swirl sniff. it around like this? Or you can swirl it, yeah. Okay. The other thing you can do at home is also put drop an ice cube into it too because as the water comes, it brings out different flavors as the ice melts. That's it's very interesting. interesting, yeah. Now this is more similar to other stuff that I've had. It's delicious. Delicious, you but think? you can taste the difference too between oh, the Oh, you can and totally the, taste there's the difference. A, so if, if people come to this birthday party for, for Wig Whiskey, they're gonna be able to have this flight and taste these and really learn about it, right? It's a full event and you can come check out the distillery. I mean, so everything is all in one place at our distillery on Smallman Street. Right. So we have, you can check out, we have a restaurant, we have incredible food, we have a full kitchen for lunch and dinner daily. Um, there's the bar and full bar. And we also have an incredible, though, you can see where our production room is, and we make everything right there. I love that because it's educational, it's fun, and it's such an incredible our corn. success story. There's your corn. So that's where this bourbon would have come Correct. from, from yep. that corn. Yep, and it goes into the mill and then goes into the tanks. It is fascinating. And, and really, you know, Pittsburgh is proud of so many different companies, and Wiggle is one of them because it's just a great history. I, I am very honored and lucky to be able to carry on the tradition that Alex and Meredith Grelly and, and their family started. So it's been a lot of fun so far. Here's what I say to that, Alex. 
Cheers. Cheers. All right. Thank you for joining us as always. And for more info on Wiggle Whiskey, just go to our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com. And right now, Mikey, we'll send it back to you. <laughs> Here's to Mikey Hood. Oh, thanks, guys. <laughs> thanks so much. What a way to cap off the week, right? And we are not done yet.